For a while now, I've been thinking about starting a new type of series. Over the past year, I've done multiple type of series, but that is old news now. We need to spice things up. And I thought to myself, I spent a lot of unhealthy amount of time on Twitter seeing very unhealthy amount of content. And there are some type of contents that I cannot make videos about because it's only going to last a minute or two. That is the exact amount of time I last. And I know you won't be satisfied with it. So I thought to myself, why not make a compilation out of these and do voiceovers over them? Even though we are in 2024, there's a lot of mindsets that are stuck in the 1800s. Starting it off with this football player. Now, it's nothing like Mexico, you know, when you miss a penalty and you get hanged from the bridge. Instead, you will get lashes if you do not score. So if you are a football player and you're planning to go to GCC, sign for millions and millions of dollars, these are the side effects. My friend, you had the ball in front of you. You cannot even score that. Come here. Shut up. I guess some things are too good to be true, but it's fine. These Brazilian football players, they will get used to it. I want to know how much money that guy had on him that this rage came out. He probably had shit ton of money bet on this <laughs> the winner team and he had the, like the ball just in front of him and he just like shot it out he was like no everyone was like it's fine try again this guy was like no no but this guy did not let it slide straight away i don't know where he brought that stick but he sh <laughs> he showed it what's up coming up straight out of wakanda what is the best thing to do to a woman who just lost her husband and she's crying at her husband's funeral propose to her Broway said no time. He saw an opportunity. He saw that window and he immediately went for it. And the crazy part was she said, yes, they have a ring. They are. She is officially married again while her husband's body is not underground yet. He is in the coffin. He is watching them from uh, heaven or hell, cursing the shit out of them. Now, this was written on the screen, but the community notes under the video said that it was her father's funeral. Still fucked up shit my best guess is the father never approved of her and bro saw an opportunity the second he died he did not waste <coughs> <coughs> what the fuck bro i just had a funeral for myself he saw an opportunity and he went for it he did not even wait for her to get back home to stop crying he went he wanted all the cameras on it because this is the most romantic shit ever your father died best romantic thing to do is to propose to you at the funeral handshake nope go to sleep next snapped coming up we have another church scam where bro is he has the holy touch he touches you you will faint i wonder the things he can do to his wife she must be the most satisfied woman in the world if with a single touch a person faints they are 100 not paid actors this is 100 percent real and if you don't believe in this you don't believe in the church and you are not a real christian i think the only way this whole thing will be believable is if he knocks the shit out of give them a right juicy hook in their face and they just fall to sleep they just go to sleep and never wake up that is the only way this whole thing will be believable and i can't believe like people are not laughing at this you go to a church and they just I'm gonna go to this church just to pull up the uno move he tries to snap my neck i'm gonna pull out the uno card he's gonna faint instead here's a hidden footage you haven't seen from the dark knight rises where batman was on his way to justice but his tail light was out so he got pulled over things got escalated fast batmobile was towed away and batman did not know the reason why and he is suing the police force but later on it turns out the police was on the joker's payroll and it was all part of the plan batman has to run to justice now i don't know who will be serving justice in gotham but it will definitely not be robin the robin is definitely spending the night with his boyfriend netflix and chilling coming up next the chinese were bored so they decided to come with a new invention where this cube light has six legs i believe and the second you wake up from your sleep at night and you want to go to the bathroom without turning on the lights you just go pss, pss, pss. It will come to you and it will directly to the toilet. Personally, if this robot decides to come and direct me to the toilet, I will pee myself the second I see this shit. Imagine you wake up at night and you see this robot walking towards you. I think the Chinese were bored and they wanted to traumatize kids. And it will be like a good prank for the parents to do towards the kids. And also how lazy can you be that you cannot get up and 
just turn on the light, go to the bathroom, or even don't turn on the light. You know, you have muscle memory stuff. You can just walk towards the bathroom and go do your business. And this shit is creepy as well. Imagine that seven-year-old you just wakes up to this robot walking towards you after like a scary uh, movie night. <laughs> I'm gonna pee myself right there. But that was it for the series. Let me know if I should do more of this. I thought it was funny if we do a compilation of it. Let me know your thoughts on these type of series. But yeah, take care of yourself. I'll see you in the next one.